Oche, and it's an area part of the Adenta constituency. And I'm reliably informed that lights here go off at least four days in a week. And businesses and residents alike are feeling the pinch of the intermittent power outages. And so a question I want answers to is whether Doomso is back. Last week, a power outage caused Williams to lose 34 cartons of chicken thighs. His cold room booster is currently experiencing a malfunction. His concern about the potential collapse of his business if the situation is not promptly addressed. Mostly they off it from morning to evening. At times to evening to the following day before it will come. The fish especially doesn't have that kind correct heart like chicken, turkey wings and those stuff. It normally spoils in a possible time. He believes that a quick solution to the situation would be a load shedding schedule, allowing him to make informed decisions. Don't saw his back. Because I may say mostly those time our past president, our ex president Mahama time, I think it was the same thing. Godwin is located not far from Williams. He operates a barber salon, which is also reeling under the power outage. Despite having a standby generator as an alternative, he intends to push the extra cost to his clients. We should call it speed a speed. If it is doom so, it is doom so. But trying to hide behind, let's say, political colors and say, oh, doom so is better in our term than the previous term or previous government, you know, it wouldn't help. We should rather face the problem up front and solve it. Over the past three months, he has been unable to make precise income projections. They're very difficult to even make plans. Maybe you, are, you have debtors to pay, you have suppliers to pay, you have employees to pay. And all these um, financial obligations are dependent on whatever happens with your sales. So if you're not able to realize those monies, it becomes very difficult to. During our visit to Ashalibotre, Alhaji Musa Seidu informed the news team that all his rechargeable lights have been charged due to an anticipated outage in the evening. At Botre here is very... Uh, rampant. As I speak, maybe today <laughs> I ask my family to plan for it. Uh, it's really affecting us as customers too. Because before you come here to have your hair cut, you've planned for something. Maybe you have a program to attend which is based on time. So you are here in, maybe in the middle of the haircut and the light goes out. <laughs> it's a bad feeling. Power providers are facing increasing pressure to come out with a low shedding schedule to manage the intermittent power outages. George Queening, TV3 News, Ashalibotri, Accra.